Welcome dear friends of primary four. Today we will start with family and friends for unit seven. Wish you a happy term and wish you all success with the spotlight. Okay, in unit seven, will it really happen? Will it really happen? We are asking, we are asking about the future here. What will happen? It didn't happen yet. It's not now, it's not yesterday, it's tomorrow or in the future. Tomorrow or in the future. Mustaqbal. In the future. Again, in the future. So here we are speaking about the future. The future. What's a chair? Aha, uh -huh. let's remember. T U R E, say it chair. Again. T U R E say it sure. Future. 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 Future, which means a mustabal. What's going to happen? What will happen? What will happen? What will happen? This is a the future. Okay, when it comes to speak about the future, we always speak about a traveling to space. This is a very interesting topic. So, how can we travel to space? A, A says I am A at the end, magic E, and you remember that C plus E equal S. Space. Again, space. S. P, A says I am A, at the end the magic E, and this is C plus E equals a space. How can we travel to space? Uh-huh, using a spaceship. Space-ship, one word. It's a spaceship, or, ah, uh, yes, rocket. We use a spaceship or a rocket. Rocket is a greedy word. I say ro and I write CK to say the K sound here. Rocket. Spaceship. Spaceship. Rocket. Again, spaceship or rocket. To travel to space. To travel to space. Who is the one who travels on, in space? The man who travels in space is called Astro. No, O, this O is a U, astronaut, again, astronaut, astronaut, a spaceman or astronaut, he wears a space suit, he wears a space suit, so to travel to the space in a space ship or in a rocket. The man who travels in space is called astronaut. He wears a space suit. He wears a space suit. When he goes to space, he sees different stars, moon, the sun, and other planets. 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 We live in a, on a planet. Our planet is called Earth. Our planet is called Earth. We write it in capital E because it's a name. Earth is a planet. Take care, it's not a plant, it's not a plane, it's a planet. 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 Okay. What else? You know how can we watch TV, different channels on TV? Uh, using the dish that uh, uh, gets signals from space because there are satellites in space. Satellite. Double L. I says I am I at the end. Magic E. Satellite. Satellite. Sorry. Satellite. Satellite, again, satellite. So the satellite is the machine that goes in space to send signals. Send 
signals send signals to the to the earth to let us watch different things okay let's read the story here in your book open it let's read it listen amy and leo have to go back to australia oh no will they miss our holiday it's in two weeks time in two weeks time this is an expression we should learn in two weeks time in two weeks time so let's highlight it in our book in two weeks time again in two weeks time no they won't they will be here for another four months so they will attend the holiday max did you hear what mom said <clears throat> yes but look at this magazine it says there will be super fast planes and it will take less than five hours to fly from england to australia amazing that's very fast will it really happen well the magazine says it will so in the future there won't be any more long plane journeys so the journey the time to travel by plane will be faster it will be less time than now that's good long plane journeys are boring mom can we go on a super fast plane to visit amy and leo in australia for the weekend it will only take few hours well there aren't any planes like that yet but maybe one day yes maybe one day let's look at the grammar lesson here it's about using will to speak about the future using will to speak about the future we say we will travel to space in the future we will travel to space look at after will we have the infinitive or the baby verb infinitive or the baby verb I say he will travel not travels not traveling so after will use the baby verb after will use the baby verb will can work as a helping verb so when I make question, I say, when will he come? When will he come? So it can work as a helping verb in the question. When will he come? Again, okay? when will he come? Question word, helping verb, subject, main verb. When will he come? When will she eat? When will he go? Okay. And because it is a helping verb, so it can carry not. I will stay at home. I will stay at home. I will not go out. I will stay at home. I will not go out. I will not go out. So to neg negate or to make negative, I can use will to carry not. I can use will to carry not. And I have a very important notice here. Will plus not equals want. Equals want. When I make the short form, I write it like this. So take care. Want. Because he always makes it in the quiz as a trick for you. For example, uh, there will be uh, some living uh, animals in the future. If we want to change it into negative, it means add not. So there won't be, some will be, any. Let's write it. There will be some people living on other space. People living on other planets in the future. Change into negative or negate 
He can use this verb, negate, or change into negative. So he wants me to add not. يبقى ويل هتبقى want. There won't be. There won't be. And some, remember, some becomes any in the negative. There won't be any people living on other planets in the future. طب what are the key words of the future? Huh. Next, next month, next last time, tomorrow, in the future, take care of the spelling of future, T-U-R-E say, T-U-R-E say, T -U -R -E say chur. So next plus time, tomorrow, or in the future, or any word that shows that the time didn't happen, not happening now, it will happen. Okay? Let's start to answer some of our exercises here. Here you will start with choosing the correct word. Look at the picture and circle. You have here, uh, supply the missing letters. Complete with will or want. We have the sun, it's too hot. Will or want? Yes, right. We want visit the sun. It will be too hot. Ha, crowded. Be crowded on the moon? No, it won't. Will it be crowded? Because I can use will as a helping verb. We said in the future, will can work as a helping verb. We have travel in rockets. We will travel in rockets. We want to travel in cars. Okay, now we have here some explanation and more exercises on the grammar. After that, let's do an exam, different exam types of questions. You know that your exam start with the vocabulary practice on some choose exercises. Then we have the grammar practice or structure with the do as shown or rewrite, complete the missing parts of the dialogue. We have a comprehension passage. We have a writing composition, orthography, or supply the missing letters, and handwriting. We will start to do some of the exercises here. What will you do in the... Uh, if I have will, I choose past or present or future. Yes, I have will. To tell me that I should ch choose the word future. A or an astronaut or satellite or planet is the one who travels in space. Huh? Who travels in space? Yes, astronaut. Planet, satellite, space, travel above the earth. They help us use mobile phones and TV. What is that? Planets? No, planet is like the earth. Other planets that people live in. Other uh, creatures live in. Satellites and the space. Uh, yes, the satellite is the machine that goes around the earth and help us use the mobile phones and TV because they send signals. They send signals. We will go a holiday. What is the preposition we used before holiday? In holiday, on holiday, at holiday. Aha, uh -huh, take care here. Any word? That has day, we use the preposition on. We use the preposition on. On before two Ds. Days and dates. Days and dates. On before. Days and dates. Two Ds. Days and dates. If I have a full date, I use on. If I have a word that has day, I use on also. Before months, we use in. If a Paul's wedding is in August. In three days, time. I don't enjoy autumn. It's the worst season. Okay. Thanks for watching. Wish you the best of luck. And wish you success with your spotlight on family and friends. And goodbye.